Hello, this is Rita from Wacom. Uh, now I'm at the Tokyo venue of Connected Inc. 2021. As you can see, a lot of talk sessions are being held this year. So now the stage is uh, on stream one, but um, I'd like you to follow me to the booth tour uh, for the next 30 minutes. This is an exclusive opportunity. So first of all, pilot. Since I was a student, I have spent time with pilot products, even for my exams. So today, I'd like to interview Iwami-san of Pilot, who knows everything about Pilot. Thank you, Iwami-san. I'm Junichi Iwami of Pilot. So um, here's Dr. Grip. This is my 32nd year since I joined Pilot, which is the same age as Dr. Grip. So today, I like to show the um, analog stationary chaos uh, to Rita-san. So first of all, this is fountain pen. Junko Kurihara uh, is going to introduce. Uh, in 1918, the business was founded, and uh, uh, we are the first uh, company to produce uh, domestic fountain pen. So uh, I would like Rita-san uh, to test try our uh, fountain pen. So this pen has been loved by fans for over 100 years. Yes. So this is for bold lines. Am I holding it the right way? Yes, please try it out. It's very easy to control the pressure. It's very soft. The fountain pen uh, is based on uh, water liquid, uh, so you don't need any pressure. Uh, recently, so um, as you said, uh, Rita, you can try the uh, thinner line model. Let me try. I think a thinner line is preferred by women. Yes, uh, I think it looks better uh, than what I write normally. This is soft type S. So um, the tip sways a little bit, just a little bit. Wow, that's true. It's metal, but um, I don't know if it can be filmed, but I can see that the tip sways. Yes, uh, we have different models of fountain pen, so you can choose the type of tip that you prefer. I didn't know there are so many models. Rita? Rita? It's time. So uh, you can come back later. There are many more to tell you about. So, Dr. Grip is the main theme of our booth this year. Akiyama-san is going to introduce. This year, uh, it is the 30th anniversary uh, of Dr. Grip. Uh, have you ever used Dr. Grip, Rita? Yes, I think everyone knows Dr. Grip. Uh, everyone has at least one. Thank you. Uh, I used Dr. Grip even uh, from before I joined Pilot. So as you uh, tried with our fountain pen, our theme is to support writing. And uh, we have supported analog writing in our history, but uh, based on Dr. Grip technology, we would like to support digital writing. That is why we developed the prototype Dr. Grip Digital. Please try it. Okay, this is Dr. Grip Digital. Yes, the um, softness of the grip um, is uh, very uh, familiar. I know this. It's the same as the analog doctor grip. So I'm a Wacom employee, so I'm uh, used to writing digital. So let me try it. 
Oh, the, you're using rock and tip, right? Yes. But this combination is actually unexpected. I think there's some synergy. It's very stable. Yes, uh, compared to writing with a Wacom pen, I think there is a unique um, writing feeling, uh, writing performance uh, of writing with Dr. Uh, Grip Digital. Um, and uh, everyone who's tried this uh, today has uh, uh, told us the same. Uh, is digital writing one of the big themes for Pilot? Yes. Um, we believe vibration is one of the key elements. A vibration from the tip to the um, grip in hand, yes. Rita, there is much more that you can um, dive into. Please follow me. So this is Writability Lab. Dr. Komatsu? Over to you. Hello, welcome. Hello. So what are you doing here? So this is what we call Writing Performance Lab. Welcome One Tablet and Pilot Corporation's Dr. Grip are used. And uh, we are offering various samples for users to find and provide data of the writing uh, performance that they prefer. I see. So you can try and uh, um, give input on what kind of um, uh, writability you prefer. Yes. And that data will be used in our research. So what are the differences between these pens? Well, please try them out. OK. And please explain. So we have different tips. We have four types. And also we have two types of uh, surface of the screen. And uh, if you touch on this icon, uh, you can change um, the type of writing instrument from three different types. Okay, so these tips are using different materials. And uh, some of them are soft and hard. Yes, I think um, the feeling is different, so please try. Okay, then I like to try type C. And uh, with the um, sticker on the screen, I, I guess the um, feeling is different. So I like to choose the fountain pen that I tried earlier. I hear the sound. Is this the sound that's um, likely to be produced by a fountain pen? Yes. Uh, we've recorded uh, the sound of fountain pen writing. I see. Uh, on the film, I guess it's a bit different. So I think there's friction on the film and uh, there's difference in writability. Yes, with the film, uh, the surface is more rough um, and uh, close to paper. I see. So with this um, different types, I guess there are eight different types. Well, um, including uh, the type of sound, uh, there are countless ways of combination. So I like to try out the 24 types uh, of, uh, of writing feeling later. And if you fill in a questionnaire, uh, we are uh, giving out a small gift. So please stop by at our booth. Yes, I'd like to come back later to look for my um, writing feeling. Thank you. So we, Pilot Corporation, want to support writing globally. Thank you, Iwami-san. Please come back later when you have time. Yes, I will. So let's go to the next booth. There are many more booths that I'd like to visit. So I'd like to stop by at the Zetokai booth. 
Hello, Watanabe-san. Can you please explain what Zetokai is? Yes, thank you. This is Watanabe of Zetokai. So um, perhaps there are uh, overseas audience as well. Well, I guess every Japanese knows what Zetokai is, but uh, for overseas audience, can you please explain um, what you do uh, as business in Zetokai? Yes, uh, we are celebrating our 90th anniversary this year. We started our business with correspondence education. And uh, as you can see on the poster, uh, we are um, having this uh, uh, vision to pioneer future uh, with uh, a quality education. Crime school, schools, uh, and uh, studying abroad uh, are some of the services that we provide. Our characteristics is uh, we are subscribed by many students uh, who are aiming to uh, enter um, the uh, top ranking universities in Japan. I see. I believe education uh, has been transforming drastically recently. Uh, for example, on the poster, I see that the student is using a tablet and a pen. And such digital transformation in such paradigm shift as Zetokai, what kind of um, initiatives have you been uh, working on? Yes, uh, Zetokai initially started uh, with correspondence education, so we uh, put value on handwriting. And uh, uh, historically, um, there was a correspondence education that you mail uh, your um, uh, answer sheets. Uh, but uh, from a few years ago, we started digital transformation. And uh, as you can see in our booth, this year, in the spring, for middle school students, uh, we've launched uh, services. Using this service, uh, students will be able to use the tablet just like paper uh, to uh, fill in their answers. And uh, in our collaboration with Wacom, uh, we'd like to um, add value uh, that is unique to digital. I see. Uh, I guess that is a very big change when we think about mailing uh, our answers. So what kind of application do you have here? Can you introduce your service? Yes, uh, this is a course for middle school students. Uh, there are five subjects that you can uh, subscribe to at the same time, and there's adaptive engine in the background. And according to the historical um, background of the student, uh, a question will be picked. And Will 3.0 from Wacom uh, is used in the scoring function. So I hope you can check that. Are we choosing mathematics? Well, that sounds difficult. Uh, I'm not aiming to enter a top level university, you know. Please look at these icons. Uh, you can find digital contents, handwriting contents, and like a honeycomb shaped. Uh, this is AI program. So let's try mathematics. I'll do my best. So this is a question for the first grade in middle school. On the left-hand side, uh, you will see the question, and right-hand side uh, is the answer sheet. This is where you answer. Yes. Uh, you cannot write with your hand. Of course, you can uh, enlarge, um, but you can write with your pen. So please check the writability. Yes, uh, I cannot really calculate in my head, so I'm going to write a random answer. Okay. So you can fill in the sheet um, just like you uh, fill out a, a hard copy paper sheet. Yes, uh, handwriting uh, feeling is uh, what we have valued the most. And I think you notice that there is um, not much slip. Uh, there is friction, just like you are writing on the paper. And uh, um, we have also valued um, uh, having small latency. And we have developed a dedicated tablet for this service. 
I see. I think this will continue to evolve, but going forward, what is going to be the direction for the Tokai? Yes, so um, in cooperation with Wacom, we will be promoting DX, and one of the direction will be um, in fiscal year 2020, new services uh, are going to be launched. And from 4 p.m., uh, we are going to be introducing those new services uh, in the session. So please look forward to that. Yes, please look forward to that. So once again, uh, from 4 p.m. today until 4.30 on the main uh, stage, uh, channel storing uh, one will be the channel where you can see the uh, service so the initiatives after 2022. You can check them out. So that was good. You put a commercial in. Good job. Thank you very much. Now, uh, time is uh, pressing, so there is one more booth that I'd like to visit uh, this year in August the world's first Samsung foldable smartphone was uh, announced and a pen comes with it. I haven't tried it yet, so I'd like to uh, ask someone from uh, Samsung to introduce their new product. So I am Hisano of uh, Samsung Japan. Well, thank you very much for this opportunity. I'd like to introduce our products in detail. So, okay, I am feeling impatient. I'd like to touch everything here. But between Wacom and Samsung, we've had 10-year partnership or more. So we, we go way back. Over the past uh, 10 years, what's been uh, happening? What sort of a partnership uh, have we been uh, enjoying? Could you talk about that? Uh, yes, of course. So Wacom and the Galaxy. This S Pen comes with um, a Galaxy's Note series. This is a very popular model series, and this uh, S Pen is where we have uh, done some collaboration for. We have been evolving uh, this S Pen. So in the first place, uh, Wacom, using digital pen on the tablet, uh, drawing illustration, and so one can deliver values to customers to provide experiences uh, to customers who would lead to their vision so people can uh, freely uh, do creative uh, work using uh, these uh, solutions. And back then, uh, Samsung, in the area of uh, smartphones, on an actual uh, notebook, you write uh, things, and just like that, on a smartphone, using a digital uh, pen, taking uh, notes was something that we wanted to realize uh, using our device. So our uh, vision corresponded to each other. We had a good match in terms of our visions. So we started a joint development, and that is how we came up with the uh, first Galaxy Note series. This uh, S Pen, using uh, Wacom's uh, technology, even today, is enjoyed by many Galaxy Note series uh, fans. They love Wacom pens. Yes, that's right. So now everybody carries a smartphone. Uh, so if there is um, a little nose you'd like to take on the uh, phone, this is very useful. Other manufacturers don't really have um, a larger screen uh, smartphones uh, with pens. They don't have uh, many models available, so in that sense, uh, we are popular. But uh, for the first time in the world, very first affordable uh, smartphone now comes with a S Pen. They are compatible, so I cannot wait any longer. Can I actually try it? Yes, this is a uh, Galaxy Z Fold uh, 3 5G is the model. Of course, you can use uh, S Pen on it. And Wacom's uh, technology is uh, used here. Uh, you can hold it up. OK. So my hand is not very big, but it fits in one of my hands. It is quite stable. Because width is um, very small, so it's easy even for a woman uh, to carry this. So you can use all the apps without opening it, and when you open it, it becomes a tablet size. That is what's special about this. Uh, so would you like to use one of the apps, uh, perhaps the orange one? Tap on that. This is a Galaxy Note, so you can use it in this uh, style as well. But if you are working in an office or you're staying at home or you're in a cafe, relaxing, sometimes you may want to use a larger screen, right? So please um, unfold it. Uh, OK. Ta-da. So now it is on a tablet mode. 
It's much easier to see, isn't it? And it's much easier for you to do something on it. So leveraging this uh, bigger screen, there are certain recommendations. So you can use um, a couple of apps together simultaneously. Like this, uh, while watching a video, for example, you can check your schedule and then using your pen, you can take notes. So for example, you can take a note about your uh, plan. Okay, so I can uh, check my schedule and while doing that, I can play music or I can watch a drama. And then you can take a little notes here and there on the screen using a pen. Yes, yeah, so you can multitask if you like, so you don't have to have a PC. Just having this one device will improve your efficiency for some business situations. Ah, in a business situation, a work setting on a larger screen, I believe that people want to do all sorts of things all at once on the same screen. Or well, since uh, the screen is uh, so big, on top of the uh, big or larger screen, do you have any other special things about this? Uh, yes, sure. Uh, do you use raw illustration? Well, I practice a little bit. And there is something that I'd like to show to you, so let me put it here. Over here, this is a Galaxy Z Fold 3 5G using um, S Pen. You can produce something as good as this, a very good quality. Well, this is something uh, drawn on a smartphone, uh, really, on a smartphone. Yes, uh, so there is a fast forward version of the uh, drawing uh, process. So yes, uh, that, and this was recorded and then this is fast forward. So on a smartphone, illustration of this uh, quality can be produced. In non-business uh, in, in non settings, this is useful. In creative settings, this is useful. Well, since this is a good opportunity, I'd like to ask you to draw something on it and tap on that. The pen size is 1.5 millimeters, so you can draw really thin, sensitive lines. You can enjoy a very sensitive, a precise touch, and also there is no lag, time lag or latency. So when you write something, the line follows very smoothly, so you can enjoy a natural feeling, a natural sensation. And professional illustrators really like this, admire this. Do you like it? What do you think? Yes, it is um, a natural without me thinking too hard about it, the writing of pressure, expression, or it feels like the ink is uh, coming out immediately after I move the tip, so it's not stressful. Well, thank you very much. Uh, so you can produce as good as, as good a drawing as the one I just uh, showed you, so please enjoy. So it's been on a Galaxy Note. Is it used to produce some um, these uh, drawings? Wow. So not just in business settings, but in your private setting, when you go out or when you're staying at home, while enjoying, you can produce illustrations. So in um, a creative settings, uh, this is something that is really for you. Yes, it fits in my hand quite nicely. Oh, thank you very much, Z Fold 3. And this is Z Flip 3, different model. It fits right into your hand and palm. It's a compact design, and also you can fold it vertically like this. This is um, a vertically foldable uh, smartphone. So this is uh, Z series. If you like it, uh, please check our official website. Oh, there are all sorts of um, uh, shapes, and I think uh, you can use them for various uh, purposes. Okay, uh, thank you very much. Uh, I'd like to enjoy myself a little bit more, but uh, maybe I'll come back later. Thank you. Uh, there are so many booths out here, uh, but um, uh, many of them remain active until 9 p.m. Uh, the event will be continuing, so if you have time, do please visit the booths. You can join on the day. Walking is uh, possible, so do please uh, come. So I'll be waiting for you. Thank you very much.